Hi folks, this is Jay. Hope you're okay today. We're looking at 2 Thessalonians chapter 1 verse 7 and 9. 2 Thessalonians. 2 Thessalonians. Uh, chapter 1 verse 7 and 9. It says, and To give you who are troubled rest with us when the Lord Jesus is revealed from heaven is mighty, with his mighty angels. In flaming fire taking vengeance on those who do not know God and on those who do not obey the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ. Christ. These shall be punished with everlasting destruction for the presence of the Lord and from the glory of his power. There is a day coming when Jesus is coming and if you don't believe in the Lord Jesus, if you don't follow him, he's saying there will be a day of destruction, there will be a day of catastrophe for you. There is a hell. That's what the Bible warns. So you've got to escape the flames of judgment now while you can. And believe in Jesus Christ now. Please, it's serious. I don't care if you're a famous atheist or not a famous atheist. It's really serious business. You need to get right with God now. And if you trample on his word, he will judge you even today. So please, please, while you can, turn to Christ now and avoid the wrath to come. Okay? Please. He says, And to give you and to give you who are troubled rest with us when the Lord Jesus is revealed from heaven with my, his mighty angels in flaming fire taking vengeance on those who do not know God and those who do not obey the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ there's going to be a day of vengeance and judgment on you they shall be punished with everlasting destruction from the presence of the Lord and from the glory of of his power. I don't want you to go to hell atheist. I don't want you to go to hell if you don't believe in God. I want you to believe in God and find peace. So please trust in Christ. Please believe in him. He says he is the way, the truth and the life. He says he's the light of the world. He says come to me if you're thirsty. Come to Christ and trust in him. Please and avoid the hell and judgment to come. Please I ask in Jesus name. Thank you.